This is the top secret way to tell if you are traumatized. Nobody is talking about this. And in fact, you will only find it in this video. When you have been gaslighted into oblivion by a narcissist or an abuser, you are so confused. You don't even know if you're the toxic one or if it's them. If up is down, if left is right, it's all so confusing. But a sign that you are traumatized is how you are thinking about yourself. If you have an internal monologue, when you're talking to yourself, are you speaking in I statements or you statements? If you usually think in terms of, I have to go to the store, I have to pay my rent, and now your thoughts lately have been, what are you doing? How could you do that? Why are you staying with this person? How are you going to get out of this relationship? That is a sign that you are traumatized. That is you splitting off from yourself. In other words, your mind is trying to separate you from yourself because you feel so much shame and confusion that your mind is going into self-preservation mode. When you are in an abusive relationship, your frontal cortex shrinks. You can see it on an MRI. So continuing to stay with this narcissist and this abuser is physically shrinking your brain, is making your mind separate from itself, and is crushing your spirit, or whatever you wanna call your essence, the things that make you, you. That's why you're not acting like yourself because you are not yourself in this relationship. And in self-preservation, as your frontal cortex shrinks, your mind tries to separate from you. It says to itself, okay, that person who's being abused isn't me anymore. It's a separate entity. It's you over there. At the same time, this narcissist is also blaming you for everything and devaluing you. You need to fix yourself. You need to do more for me. You are the problem. You're the crazy one. So you are getting a double negative feedback loop as you are internalizing that and your inner thoughts are now saying what your abuser is saying on the outside. You're the problem. You're the crazy one. You need to fix yourself. You have issues. And this is why you are extremely confused and feel like garbage all the time. Now the brain is resilient and as soon as you get out of that abusive relationship, your frontal cortex goes back to normal and you will start having the thoughts, I'm so proud of myself that I got me out of that horrible situation. I can now live a bright, beautiful future. 